Hey guys, welcome back and today we are looking at the EK Waterblocks radiators. We have the S360 and the P360, both have the same size but a different thickness. So let's see in this video how they perform. The S360 is slimmer, perfect for tighter cases, while the P360 is thicker with more cooling surface and in theory it should perform better. I tested both in the exact same setup on our bench table where we kept the heat dissipation constant and only adjusted the fan speed from low noise to maximum. One thing EcoWaterBlock really nails is build quality. Beautiful silver Miniman caps, sleek black side panels and cooling fins. And even chrome plated threads for the fittings. Everything feels premium and very well finished. Here's a quick inside look. You can clearly see the fin structure and water channels that drive the thermal performance. Let's go for the test results first at low fan speed. At 1100 RPM, the S360 capped a water to air delta of 18.6 Celsius, while the P360 reached 21.2 Celsius. So at lower speeds, the thinner radiator actually does better. What a surprise. The test results at high fan speed show a different outcome. So cranking the fans up to 3000 RPM changes the picture. The S360 dropped to 8.4 Celsius, but the P360 pulled ahead at 7.2 Celsius. The extra thickness pays off once airflow increases. Let's go for the conclusion. In short, with low fan speed, the S360 is the better choice. When you go for high fan speed, the P360 clearly wins. Which one is better for your build depends on your needs, the cooling performance, the quietness and the space you have in your case. Thank you for watching and please subscribe and write in the comments which radiator you would prefer so we can continue making more videos like this. See you next time again. Bye bye.